ZKPP1KPWM Pulse Signal Generator. The signal generator has two modes, PWM and Pulse. Generates PWM and Pulse signals. Its input voltage range, 3.3 volts to 30 volts. Output PWM and Pulse signals. Wiring diagram. Mode selection. PWM mode, after power on, there is PWM waveform output. Out appears in the upper left corner of the screen. Do not output PWM to power on. Two switches can be connected externally at the output end. First off switch. After power on, press on, after out disappears, the module does not output PWM wave. The switch can be closed at this time. No waveform output. Press on again. Out appears in the upper left corner of the screen. Output waveform at this time. The first line of numbers, 10 indicates that the PWM frequency is 10 kHz. The second line of numbers, 60%, indicates that the positive duty cycle of the PWM is 60%. This can be done by pressing the addition and subtraction keys of FRAC P. Sets the output frequency. Press the add, subtract key of the duty, N key. Sets the positive duty cycle size. Observe the waveform detected by the oscilloscope. The visible frequency is 10 kHz. A square wave with a duty cycle of 60%. Pulse mode switch to pulse mode by holding down the SET key for 6 seconds. Percent disappear. This is pulse mode. The number in the first line is 0 0.05. The time for positive pulse width is 0 0.05 seconds. That's 50 milliseconds. Second line digit. 0 0.05 indicates a negative pulse width of 0 0.05 seconds, or 50 milliseconds. By pressing the add, subtract key of frac P. Set the time for positive pulse width. Press the add. Subtract key of the duty, N key. Set the time for negative pulse width. Observe the waveform detected by the oscilloscope. The square wave has a positive pulse width of 50 milliseconds. The negative pulse width is also 50 milliseconds. Pattern test completed.